Hello, I'm delighted to present to you today the latest version of Cisco Jabber for Google Apps. It is based on the latest release of the Jabber SDK, uh, which is available since uh, May 2012. Uh, that new SDK brings video directly to your web applications. Right. So I'm going to show uh, that new Jabber gadget integrated into Gmail. So you may be familiar with the Jabber sidebar gadget that you can currently see on the left of your screen. From there you can place and receive calls and control those calls directly from your Gmail page. So what we've done uh, for this new uh, version is uh, we've basically added new features in the to the expanded view. Right. So if I click here that expand button that will show me, show me uh, a larger view of my Jabber for Google Apps. Uh, so you, 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 you know from there you can search uh, contacts with like advanced information. So let's say I'd like to place a call uh, to Patrick. So I'm gonna search for his name here. Patrick Mo. Yeah, he's here. I, I select his name and click that call button. So hopefully uh, Patrick will answer. Uh, Hey Patrick, how are you doing? So you see, we can we can see the large video there directly from Gmail, and I can always go back to my inbox. I'm still in a call. We show that tiny video uh, on the left sidebar, and returning to my expanded view, I can still uh, see Patrick in a call with me. Uh, thanks, Patrick. T -t Talk to you later. Bye bye. Uh, let's see what what was added to that expanded view then. Um, so the second tab is about call history. So here I've got uh, all my previous uh, missed, received, and the old calls uh, shown in that list. I can just filter them. So if I want to hide the old calls, I can just click that button and bring them back there. And I can. Just click one, I one log item to uh, call back the, the, the caller. Right. So by the way, that was made by Patrick with just called. So well done, well done, Patrick. Um, another tab we've added is uh, a voicemail integration with the, the Cisco voicemail server, which is called Unity Connection. Right. So the latest version of Unity Connection has uh, a web inbox built in. So that's what we use for this integration. So that's it. I've got I've got a visual voicemail directly from uh, from uh, my Gmail page, right? I can I can listen voicemails. I can post new ones. Uh, I can even say I select that message here from from Jing, right? So imagine you're you're at your desk and you've got your uh, Cisco hard phone IP phone, so which is something like that. Right, so that's my 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 desk phone, and I c I can from there, for example, mark the the message unread, right? And if I go back to my desk phone, it will then show the the voicemail indicator, right? So that shows you like a a, a deep integration with your Cisco phone. And let me switch to the next tab. So it's called Calendar. It's it's. It's a basic integration with your Google Calendar, so it's it's more like a preview. And a typical use case would be um, you're you're in a call, and someone asks you if you're available tomorrow or next week on Tuesday. So you could have a quick look from there without opening any new tab, and 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 say, well, yes, I'm available or not. Um, the last tab here it's called settings. So bringing all those new features uh, requires configuration so for now it's it's manual configuration and you can from there enter your phone credentials uh, your voicemail server address and you've got here at the bottom of the screen some uh, version information about the the Jabber SDK plugin and and other things um, so that's basically what I wanted to show you today. One last thing we've added is if I go back to my inbox then you see here I've received uh, an email from Patrick. If I open the email 
then we've added uh, what Google uh, calls a contextual gadget so that this is that the, the, the Jabber footer here so it can extract information from the current email for example the, the sender of the email and we resolve that contact and suggest uh, to click to call uh, the email sender All right, so that, that will start a call as, a, uh, as I've shown before from the expanded view uh, just so you know, we've now uh, a, a kind of like stable channel available for uh, the, the the gadget releases. So you would get uh, automatic updates and and much more. So feel free to get in touch with us on the Cisco Developer Network, in short CDN, right at this URL, and and we'll we, we'll get in touch with you about deploying the gadget and and testing it. Thanks for your attention and talk to you soon.